kind of the same story with these other beds back here. There's some material that can be distributed and spread around after the weeds are pulled up and um, put on the burn pile. This is the daylily bed that is in pretty good shape. It just needs some weeding uh, around the, the lilies, which are uh, doing pretty good since they were transplanted. Same way here, all this one has a lot more growth. So um, all those, pretty much everything that's not a day lily needs to come out of there. Now we're getting some late blooms. And the same way on this bed here, on this uh, water oak, which is uh, also got a lot of weed growth. So just take care of all of that and um, leave the day lilies. And then Tina just generally wants you to weed in the garden areas. Uh, I've sprayed some of the pathways with some weed killer, but um, if you see weeds in there, you know, feel free. We've got quite a bit going on in, in here right now. We haven't had a chance to do much ourselves. Don't worry about this section of the yard or the pool, or excuse me, the old deck area by the pool. I've killed this and we're getting ready to do something different in here anyway. Um, on the deck itself, you can see these kinds of weeds, those can come up all over. And, um, you know, pretty much the same story over on the other side. You've done it before. So, uh, any questions, uh, give us a call. She's also going to have you water uh, a lot of the plants, and I know she's going to have some specific instructions for you on that.